concert is coming up on Friday, December 13th at 7 p.m. at the Ara Muse Hall at Jeju National University. Wow. The concert will feature Skull and Haha, Romantic Punch, Freestyle, Big Star, and Bestie. Details are on our music access message board, so please check that out. Just click www.arirangfm.co.kr music access and leave me a message on our music access message board. Let me tell you about <clears throat> what's coming up next in just a moment on part two. Ooh. We'll be here with Benjamin on Who's Following Now to learn more about the social networks of the stars. Come have fun with us. You can download the Arirang application on your smartphones or listen on your computers at www.arirangfm.co.kr slash music access. We're also on Terrestrial DMB. And we've got FM station on Jeju Island. It is 88.7 in Jeju City. And 88.1 in Sagipo City. And 101.9 in Daejeon area. Alright, let's listen to a song. Before we come back with Who's following now? It is requested by Jesse from USA. Non Negative Bure by Boys Republic. Everyone's on SNS these days, even our top celebrities. Right, if you look at their SNS, we can see their personal connections. So let's find out which star is following who with. Who's following now? Before we get to know each other, uh, Benjamin, please say hello to our Music Access family. Yes. Hello, Music Access family. Thank you for tuning in today and, and uh, you know, get some refreshments, sit back, and uh, enjoy the show. Wow, you sound so nice. Now it's time for introduction. Hello, I'm Sangbom of Demion. And I'm Nakun. It's so nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Okay, now before we, we go any further, yeah. uh, Sangbom, I heard that you're the funny one. Yeah, right. I'm the funny okay, one. Okay, <laughs> and uh, Nagun, you're the, you're the formal, formal shy one. That's shy what that's one. what our producer yeah. said. Yeah, you're I'm the pretty, shy I'm one. Pretty shy. <laughs> I'm, I'm blushing. You I'm seem blushing. Like a shy yeah, so yeah, he is are, blushing. Are, right you're now. all blushing right now. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's great. Too much interest. <laughs> okay. Yesterday we heard from the music access writer about this segment, and you, Benjamin, I heard that you're the heart and soul of this segment. <laughs> what a compliment. Oh yeah. What's your secret? How do you do it so well? Um, a couple things. One. I you know try to do a lot of research oh, about what we're going to talk about, right? Yes, right. And I try to you know pick out what's interesting and what's not interesting, and try yeah. to you know oh. sort it out. The other thing is, I think maybe just you know I have a good relationship with Aaron, you know, mm. good chemistry. He's a good yes. guy. Uh, we became good buddies guy. doing oh. the show, you know. So yeah, that's it. You know, just try to have fun. <laughs> wow, <laughs> so that's cool. So uh, right now we have the camera on, and oh, Benjamin, yeah. you are a I very good-looking guy. Yeah. I think our fans would like to see you. Can yeah. you wave to the camera? I mean, he's got ah. the Hello, I don't know shape. if I'm, I'm waving it, at it or not. The, but oh, there it is up yeah, there. Yeah. Okay. Hey, guys. <laughs> Hi. Oh, my gosh. So, like Nakun said, Benjamin is very handsome. Yeah, he is. He is. Oh. No, so, no, 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 no. So, I think it would be very popular, right? So, were you popular back in your, like, hometown, Tennessee? Maybe. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> maybe. 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 We don't know. Okay. <laughs> you know, we lived abroad too, and sometimes mm. we talk about how the standard of beauty here in Korea is so different from the yeah. other countries. Do yes. you agree with that? Very much, yes. Uh, mm. You know, sometimes if you see like a Korean guy or Korean girl with a foreigner, yeah. mm. they're, they're kind of, you, know, you think, oh, it's a, it's a bit of a mismatch. You know, mm. you can't, because you can, when you uh, don't know someone else's culture, you can't tell like, yeah. Uh, exactly. Uh, you know, are they really that cool or yeah. good looking in their culture? You know, mm. so you, you see that sometimes. Oh, yeah, yeah, very, very different standards, I think. <laughs> so, Ben, what kind of girl would you consider to be very beautiful? Very beautiful. Well, I like a girl that's smart, first of all. Oh, the smart. smart yes, point. smart oh. girls. But, um, you know, maybe I heard you guys talking about like what kind of girls yeah. you like yeah. when I was waiting to come oh, in. Oh, yeah, 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 you heard that. So, <laughs> you guys like cute girls? Yeah, yeah. cute yeah. girls. I like, uh, you know, Beautiful girls, mm. natural face, that natural kind of face. thing. Oh, yeah. okay. In Korea, when a guy meets a girl for the first time, but they're not really their type, they usually say, oh, you're very cute. <laughs> I've, <laughs> or, se I've seen this firsthand. Uh, uh, really? Yeah. Oh, my God. You kind of like look like my friend, so they won't hurt their feelings. In your home country, what would guys say to girls when they're not, you know, not l really their type? Oh, you know, so. I think we just have like a, you know, like our tone of our voice yeah. or, or maybe we kind of focus on someone else more oh. right you know and or you can if you really need to you can always say you know 
oh, you know, I was on a date the other oh, night, you know, something like that. Something like that. Uh, yeah, you know, so we just kind of, you know, it's like instincts, right? Instincts, you know, yes. Oh, he doesn't like me. Oh, my God. Something like that. <laughs> <laughs> Does this happen to you guys a lot? Well, uh, uh, for me, in really, in, in Korea, we say like, oh, kyo, kyo, oh, it's so cute. It's, it's uh, yeah, cute. Just say she's cute. Yeah, yeah. Then, then just like, that's that's done yeah done some, done sometimes <laughs> i hear that as well oh really and, yeah i know what you mean i don't like to hear that I'm <laughs> cute, right? no and, but no guy wants to hear these yeah cute. yeah the guys are like sexy or manly yeah handsome. No, 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 that's no. what we're yeah <laughs> <laughs> and if we're like being introduced by a friend if we're what? uh being introduced to a date yeah like a blind date mm -hmm. and the friend asks afterwards did you like her? Yeah. And if we didn't, we say like, uh, Oh, she's kind. I think, I think they're oh, nice. She was kind. She was kind. Uh, yeah. That's it. Yeah, <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. She, she'd be cool to hang out with sometimes. Oh, in yeah, a group. Like that. <laughs> oh, in a group. <laughs> that, one, that one's go. it. That one's yeah, it's over. That's a, wow. I think we're going to get a long gray. Okay, so last week, Benjamin gave us a hint for the yeah. person of this week, but left us hanging. Mm. So it's time to reveal this week's star for who's following now. And and before we do that, mm -hmm. what was last week's hint? All right, guys, let's see if you can guess who it is at home. Mm -hmm. Hint number one, this Mexican-American young mm -hmm. actress got her start as Miley Cyrus's rival on Hannah Montana. Oh. That's how she got her, her big break. Oh. Uh, number two, uh, she starred in her own show yeah. called Wizards of Waverly Place. Okay. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Somebody oh. knows. I think Somebody I know. Knows. Hint number three. Right. She may be the most. She may be most famous for dating Justin Bieber. Oh. oh. There you go. That's that's if you like don't know. That if you don't know. That makes it obvious. <laughs> wow. So what is she doing these days? Okay. Well, I gotta give her full name here. Her full name. Okay. She was born Selena Marie Gomez. Right. Oh, born yes. July twenty second, nineteen ninety two. Oh. Hmm. So. Okay. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, she's she is a busy girl. Busy okay? girl. <laughs> and the latest thing she's got going on is uh, she has two movies coming out next year. Wow. Mm. Uh, so look for those. If you're a big fan of hers, we know a lot of listeners are. Yes. Uh, it's one of them is going to be called Behaving Badly. Mm. The other one is called Rudderless. Ooh. So Rudderless. yeah, keep an eye out for those. But uh, you know, th the main thing about Selena in the news is like yes. you know certain relationship with uh, people that she dates right mm -hmm. her lovers right yes so uh, yeah we're gonna be getting into that later in the show but uh, yeah so before we do that we can just talk a little bit about uh, you know her so actually before she was on Hannah Montana she yeah. wasn't famous but she made uh, appearances on TV shows mm -hmm. like Barney and Friends oh and uh, and then so later on when she got onto Hannah Montana, that's when like she became really recognizable, right? Yeah, right. And so then she kind of had like a spinoff mm -hmm. into her own show mm -hmm. uh, on a certain channel that uh, everyone knows. And uh, so that one was called Wizards of Waverly Place, and that was a smash hit, and, oh. it, and it ran for four years. Yeah. And uh, so you know, I watched a little bit of it, you know, to prepare for this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It was pr it was better than I expected. Oh, it was, really? Yeah, it was kind of funny actually. Oh. Was yeah. it all that childish or anything? <laughs> Oh, well, it's it's a little bit, but um, you know, uh, like I said, I was expecting that kind of thing, um, you know, and, so, and, yeah. and like, oh, I'm too old for this. Oh, but it, it, I was <laughs> chuckling, you know, it's kind oh, of funny. Wow. She has magic powers, like oh, really? her, her family are wizards, right? Wow. And they have a restaurant in New York, and she's getting into trouble using the magic around the house, right? Her mom's like, right. I told you not it. to use the magic in the house. <laughs> you should watch it. Yeah, yeah, check it out. It's pretty, okay. it's not bad. Mm. Right. Okay. I can't wait to hear more about Selena Gomez and other celebrities. Before we find out, let's listen to a song. It is by Selena Gomez. Come and get it. Access with Nakun and Sangbom and Benjamin. Who's following now? Today's we today we are following Selena Gomez. I think I heard somewhere that you know Aaron is a huge Selena Gomez fan. <laughs> Man, he's gonna be kicking himself. He missed today's show. Oh my god, it's too bad. Well, <laughs> he was excited last week because really? he, he figured out who it was when oh I was giving god. the hints. Right. Wow. <laughs> I hope so, he's still listening. Yeah, he would have. He probably problems. is listening. Oh yeah. really? Oh, okay. Hi, Aaron. Anyways, he would have to, uh, up, Aaron? Yeah. <laughs> to talk about today, right, Benjamin? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So uh, next up, okay, so she's very famous, but she's also almost even more famous mm -hmm. for dating a certain person yes. named mm -hmm. Justin Bieber. Bieber. And they, yeah, they had like this, uh, you know, kind of tumultuous relationship yes. for like two years, right? Mm -hmm. I think it was about two years. I'm not sure exactly. <laughs> but uh, yeah, when they were dating, they mm -hmm. were known as Jelena. Oh, right? yeah, Jelena. Yeah. Justin. Justin plus Selena, right? Selena. Jelena. 
<laughs> I mean, I can't believe I can't. Zelina. I can't believe that. Yeah. <laughs> Zelina. Okay. Anyways, it was a, a media frenzy, right? Mm. And uh, yeah. so, uh, you know, Justin calls his uh, fans. He calls them believers, right? Believers. Yeah. yeah. And uh, she was on a, an interview, and because every time she's on an interview, like a late night talk show or something, because yeah. I, I watched a few of these to Ooh. research, and and they always always ask her about Justin, and, uh. and, you know, and she's like, "I'm no longer a believer." You can just <laughs> say it like that, you know. <laughs> okay. And, and one time she was talking about you know how she made him cry oh, and all this stuff. Cry. I mean, can you? Why? How can a girl, yeah. you know, spill it like that? How can she just go and tell everybody yeah. that you cried? That's, That's not right. That's weird. I mean, yeah, too, I mean too. that is revenge. That is revenge. Yeah, revenge. That is cold <laughs> revenge right here. Core hearted. Okay, so. so I have, I, well, I got a question for you guys. Yeah. Has a girl ever broken your heart? Has a girl ever made you cry? Awful. I think our, I think maybe our listeners yeah. would be interested in oh. this answer. <laughs> actually, wow. but I, okay, because I can imagine maybe yes. you've made a few ladies cry uh, over the years. Oh, actually, but have you ever cried? Mm, I think we all have, like. Every yeah. guy. Oh, you guys. Yeah, you seem like sensitive guys. <laughs> yeah. sincere, very sincere. <laughs> sincere Especially guys. you, Nakun. What happened to you? Did you cry? Me? Yeah. I think you're the mo- mo- more more emotional. The funny guys always are. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they, they always are emotional. Yeah. I am emotional. I'm going to cry. <laughs> okay. Anyways. Uh, we like Solana and Gomez too, so uh, don't worry. Let's take a look at the first connection. Who is it? Oh, okay. Sorry. Well, that was it was Bieber. Uh, oh, Bieber yeah, was the, the first Bieber. connection. Oh, connection yeah, 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 it's it's okay. But uh, the next thing I was going to talk about was mm-hmm. okay. So the newest, the latest thing with Bieber now is yeah. he's got this uh, like a, it's kind of a 3D movie type thing coming Ooh. out. It's called Believe 3D, right? <laughs> and it's come it's coming out on Christmas Day. Oh, yeah. And uh, so what he's doing to promote it is he is uh, making every Monday he releases a song oh. on the internet, right? And That's the okay. latest song he released is called mm-hmm. uh, All Bad. All bad. All and bad. and like the it sounds like it's about Selena, oh. right? And so like oh. all the all the internet yeah. gossip, oh. yeah, is about it's about her, right? And yeah. you know, so I got some of the lyrics here. Mm. Wow. Uh, if it ain't one thing, it's another. Insta- instigators like pouring fire on propane. The wrong thing. They won't be worried about you. Oh, females, you know, it wasn't. All, I wasn't all bad, you know. Oh. So he's trying to say like, you know. We, you know, it kind of blew up like a flame yeah. in the end, like a bomb or something. But <laughs> I, it wasn't all bad. I'm a nice guy, Aww. you know. It's and he doesn't say sorry, yeah. but it kind of seems Ooh. a little bit like an apology, a little Aww. bit, right? So he's defending himself and apologizing without s- without apologizing, wow. <laughs> without, <laughs> without, apologizing. Apologizing. without actually doing it. Wow, wow. he's really great. He's like brilliant. Oh wow. my goodness! So does he uh, write the songs himself? The the one that he uh, every week he does write songs. I don't. But I think his big ones are like the, his big hits. I think those are uh, produced and written by someone else. Mm. But he, but uh, in the, on his last album, he had a lot more influence. Like, uh, oh, what was that big hit? That single he released with his last album. Anyway, I can't remember. But uh, he wrote that, and so it was like a big deal. Or he uh, had a lot of influence on writing it. Mm-hmm. So it was a big deal that he, you know, controlled that song a lot. You know, oh. because before that, he had other people doing it. So I'm curious about the lyrics for "All Bad." Did he write that himself too? Well, that's, I'm not sure. I couldn't. It could, it's so brand new mm. that um, I'm not like that hasn't there, come out no yet. Yeah, yeah. I don't I haven't got that much information. Oh. It sounds. I mean, he has to have oh. at least written some of it, right? <laughs> yeah, right. yeah. <laughs> it's got to have. So it's much influence. Really. So, uh, who's the second connection? All right, second up today we have. Uh, Britney Spears. Ooh, Britney. And uh, okay, so she's got a new album coming out December third. Mm-hmm. And you know, oh, and also this year she was on Miley Cyrus's album Bangers. Oh. Right? And so she's uh, she's been busy. But okay, so what's the connection with Selena? Right. Mm-hmm. Um, there was a movie that came out earlier this year called Spring Breakers. Oh. Right? And it's about like these girls. They go on spring break in Florida, yeah. uh, and they get in a lot of trouble, a lot of mm. riffraff, right? right. <laughs> Up to no good down there. Yeah. And uh, so, like, yeah, that's. Uh, but the girls are always singing Britney Spears songs oh. to themselves, like when oh. they're having fun or they're bored or whatever. Oh. They just start singing Britney Spears songs. Yeah. And the most famous scene in the movie is like uh, it's like they have a piano out on the ocean, right? Oh. And James Franco's in this movie. James oh, Franco's really? playing the piano. Yeah. Really? Oh, okay. Yeah, and uh, so. They're like, you know, sing me, sing me something yeah. that inspires me. So he, <laughs> they play, uh, he starts playing every time Britney Spears song and oh, they all yeah. sing it. And it's like the sun's going down and they're yeah. in these pink, ma- like uh, ski masks. Mm-hmm. Anyways, 
it's a, kind of an iconic <coughs> scene. So mm-hmm. that's it. So after that, I think like uh, Britney started following her. Yeah. Or they started oh. following each other wow. on Twitter. Right. So that's kind of how their link happened. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Beautiful. Okay. Wow. How about the like third connection? Uh, well, let's get to him after the break. Oh, after okay, after okay. we get uh, through the next one, and then we'll talk about him. Okay, so, so. let's do the song uh, before we come back to find out more about Selena Gomez, famous online friends. So why don't you? Uh, this is All Bad by Justin Bieber. So listen to the lyrics, guys. Yes. Yes, getting the who's who <laughs> on Hot Celebrities and with who's following now. We are following the personal connections of Selena Gomez this week. We already talked about Britney Spears and Justin Bieber. Who else do we have? All right, last up today we have Zayn Malik. Oh, okay. One, Direction. One Direction. Yeah, he's in One Direction. Yes. And uh, yeah, so he's the last one we have up today. Mm-hmm. And so, okay, so the word on the street is that, uh, you know, they're dating. Oh. But he's, dating. he's dating Selena Gomez. Wow. Right? She yeah. just has a type. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, you know, kind of like after they broke, after she broke up with yeah. Bieber, with Justin Bieber, right? Mm-hmm. There was like this period where like everything that they did mm-hmm. or said about each, they were always asked questions mm-hmm. about each other. Yes. And uh, so, you know, people were trying to like, uh, you know, get a reaction out of her, mm-hmm. get her to keep talking about him. Yes. And so like in an interview, they were they were like I think the guy was being a little cheeky like oh so what do you think about the One Direction guys right oh. and uh, she said that uh, the cutest one was Zayn right yeah, yeah and that she wanted to kiss him mm. and I think this is before they ever met now she is one of her good friends I don't know if this is common knowledge but one of her good friends is Taylor Swift right oh, and yeah. Taylor Swift was dating Harry Styles mm, which yes. was who was also in the in One Direction yeah so. Uh, she ended up meeting Zane through Taylor, oh. right? That's how they started to, that's how they met and initially started to hook up or whatever, you know. Mm. So, um, yeah, but, uh, you know, there are a lot of rumors out there. Like when you when you search, yeah. like Selena Gomez dating, you know, whatever, yeah. a lot of stuff comes up. But there were pictures. Oh. There's proof in the pudding, proof. right? Proof. <coughs> Paparazzi shot. Proof is in the pudding. That is just official. <laughs> yeah, so there there are pictures of them kissing, smooching on camera. So mm. smooching so it up. Smooching, that's off the yeah. show. <laughs> that is. Okay. Yeah, and uh, okay, so yeah, they're dating now and uh mm. le- okay, so what's up with him now? He Oh, they got a new album coming out. Oh. oh. I think it comes out like Monday. Monday. Monday or Tuesday, yeah. Okay. Uh called Midnight Memories. Mm. So that's coming out from One Direction, right? I think oh. it, you know, this highly anticipated. I think it is the I think it's the third album that Ooh. they've done. I'm not sure, but yeah, uh, I think I think so too. Yeah, third album. Yeah, and uh, so to promote it, they they've been performing on uh, the American and British TV show called X Factor. X yeah. Factor. You guys know X Factor? Yeah, you yeah. like that? Yeah. <coughs> yeah. So, yeah, that's that's what's up with them right now. Mm. Yeah. Okay, mm. that's cool. So we put the spotlight on Solana Gomez for who's following now today. Mm-hmm. Can you sum up the SNS connections for us? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, first up we have Bieber. Mm-hmm. And uh, so, long story short is, she is no longer a believer. A believer. Uh, right? <laughs> yeah. That's done. That's yeah. done. She doesn't believe anymore. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> second up, we had the one and only, mm-hmm. the legend, Britney Spears. Britney Spears. Yes. And last but not least, we uh, come to Zayn Malik of mm-hmm. uh, One, one Direction. Direction. And yes. Uh, yeah, so that's her new bow. That's the that's the new thing on the street right now. Okay, so well, we have one more friend left, and that person will be in the spotlight next week, next right? Next week, Benny? right? Yes, yes. yes. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you guys some hints. Yeah. Right. And uh, let's see if you can, you know, try to uh, guess who it is, and then mm-hmm. tune in next week, and mm-hmm. we're going to talk about it. Okay. All right. So hint number one: mm-hmm. this NBA star is a part owner of Liverpool Football Club Ooh, and is in talks with David Beckham to buy a pro soccer team in okay. the U.S. Okay. Okay, okay. now, don't panic. Okay. The, fir- <laughs> the, fir- the first hint is supposed to be, uh, like, you're not supposed to be able to get it. Uh, okay, right? Yeah. You know. Okay, so hint number two. I think you're going to get it now. Yeah. This four-time NBA in- MVP and two-time defending champion plays for the Miami Heat. Miami. Actually, Miami. we're not no. into like. Sports. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, no, <when> I really. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my God. So it's, it is an NBA player, and he won a lot. Okay. He's the most famous NBA player right now. Ah, uh, right now. Well, yeah. at least I know what NBA is. Oh. And oh, national man. basketball. He's <laughs> yeah. a basketball player. Yeah. Oh I should. I should probably. <laughs> this should probably explain crazy. that. <laughs> oh my God. So what's our the last last hint? And the last hint <laughs> is his nickname is King James. King, King James. Like the Bible. 
Like oh, so okay. did you get? I have no idea, <laughs> but I know what NBA stands for. Okay, okay so now. Okay. okay, okay. His 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 name is Momomo James. I'll give you that. Momomo okay. James. So, so wait, he's like, like he has a middle name? No, no, or uh, Mo James. <laughs> <laughs> Just oh. Oh. something James, right? Blah blah James, right? Oh, okay. So what? Did you get it now? No, of no, no. <laughs> so I acting. I like have no it. idea. <laughs> okay, okay, actually, we're not really into basketball. We know like uh the Jordan. Yeah, all we know Where is Michael Jordan. Jordan. Yeah, Michael I, Jordan. I love Jordan. But he, he's Michael retired and, now. Yeah, and we know Kobe. Yeah, okay. Yeah. It's not Kobe, but the other most famous guy. Oh, my playing. God. What oh. is it? It's not Kobe. Oh, my Plays God. for Miami. Plays for uh, Miami. You have no idea. He was, don't I, think. <laughs> <laughs> he's just like, have no he's, idea. He's like, he's like <laughs> pretending to rack yeah, his brain. Yeah, don't uh, do that. Okay. Okay, I'll stay uh, out. Okay. It's going to come to him if he just keeps <laughs> doing that. <laughs> Anyways, it's already time to say goodbye. Aww. So how was it, your first hour and last with us, Daniel? Yeah. Man, I had a great time with you yes. guys. But, but before we go, I wanted to ask, you know, yeah. so this is your first week on radio, right? Yeah. right? I remember my first time on the radio, and yeah. I was so nervous. So mm-hmm, right. what about you guys? Have you enjoyed the experience? Yeah, the experience was, was so fun. But uh, it's our fourth day, right? Fourth day. And yeah, now, you guys are naturals now. Yeah, right now, it's, we're kind of like, okay, but at first, second, we were like so crazy. We na- We made like... Lots of. I think we did better today because he he was such a. Benjamin yeah, you were like firm. arranging, like you're emceeing the stuff, and we were like, oh, thank you, Benjamin, <laughs> <laughs> like bring inside and. But you got you guys did a great job. It was a lot oh, of fun. Thank you so much, and thank you, Benjamin, and thanks, Benjamin, sending. Uh, we need sending to send Benjamin. you. Oh, we need yeah. to send Benjamin. And out. since we were talking about One Direction, yeah, before about Zayn Malik, yes. we should listen to a song by them. Mm, okay. Yes, we have that coming up now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The next song is One Way or Another. By One Direction. And bye, Benjamin. Bye, bye guys. Uh, bye bye. <laughs> bye. For another by One Direction and Part of Me by Katy Perry. Okay. It's now time to reveal the answer for TT Quiz Season 2 from the first hour. What are the answers? The answers were Audition. 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 We had a great hint, right? Yeah, like me. Not you. Me. A lot of people got the answer right, but we picked just one. Here is our lucky winner, Kor from Yugoslavia. Yugoslavia. Yeah, Kor. Yes. Right. Lucky. We'll post it up on our message board to make sure you to take a look. Mm -hmm. If you see your name there, send us an email at musicaccess at arirang.co.kr with your name, phone number, address, and email address. And our TT quiz present is Eminem's new album, The Marshall Mothers LP2. Congratulations! Congratulations. Let's share some more messages sent in to us by our listeners with message time. Mm -hmm. First one is from Kimberly. Hi, Kimberly. Kimberly, uh, she's from the USA. Hey, cute Changbom, yes. and why is there a bracket in my cute? <laughs> cute, <laughs> cute not cool. You're not cute. I was not having cute. a really bad day today, but I felt a little bit better knowing mm. that I would be able to hear you guys again today. Yay. The week has gone by so fast, mm. but you both did a really great job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I I hope you all can get a long-term DJ position or your own show. Yeah, I'll be looking forward to it if it happens. <laughs> wow! If it I happens. hope it happens. Yeah. Really, really, we're, we're really. looking forward to it. Okay, next message. <clears throat> Draw from Saudi Arabia. My tea's gone cold. I'm wondering why I got a I got out of bed at all. Uh. I don't need to sleep at all when all I need to hear you. Wow. That's the <laughs> that's actually the lyrics by. Uh, Really? Uh, an artist c- called Ditto. Oh, really? You know? How do you know? Because uh, she was featured in Emin- one of Eminem's songs called... Oh. I forgot the I name. Stan. Yeah, Stan. I Stan, really? Yeah, it's the one that goes, My tears gone cold and one. Ah. Yeah. See, you know. I know. It's one of my favorite <laughs> songs. Okay. Anyways. Noor Fadila from Malaysia. Mm-hmm. Oh, today you guys didn't choose my message, Aww. but now we did. We did. Noor. It's okay. Noor. I will send a lot of more messages tomorrow to make sure you guys read my message. Yes. And please send my love to Yoon. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do not be jealous. No, I'm jealous. I'm jealous. So, Yoon. Noor, we did read your message <laughs> yeah, right now. We and found you. I think you should spam more. We got you. We yeah. got you, Noor. 
And Daniel from from Australia, Australia Aussie. This Monday, did you met?、Uh, did you met the snow? Did you meet the snow? Oh, there it's not snowing, right? It was snowing on our first time. Yeah, in the DJ, in the DJ but we、Monday. couldn't see that. And what's what is snow like? I've never seen snow in real life in Australia. It never snows. It's always warm. It's getting into summer now. My favorite season is it. Well, it doesn't, doesn't snow? really snow in Australia, but there's this particular region called、uh, yeah. the Snowy Mountains. <laughs> oh, obviously. Snowy Mountains, yeah, obviously. obviously, like literally. It will snow there, and there's actually、uh, what do you call it? Ski skiing ski、spot? slope. Yeah, ski slopes、yeah. in the Snowy Mountains, and I've been there actually. Really? So it some, snows. Yeah, it snows in that area. Well, Danielle, you should come visit that place. Snowy Mountain, literally, it snows. Yeah, it's snowy. It's, well, Australia <laughs> is really big, and I don't know where Danielle lives,、oh, but Snowy Mountain. You should send us like where you live,、uh, yeah, the region up to Australia. Anyway, thank you again for your messages. We'll be listening to your request song before we come back. So the song was requested by Robin from USA. Korobunda Pi P one A four and next and requested by Maggie Maddie sorry Maddie、mm-hmm. from Singapore Diary by Nabi. Music access with Sang Moment Nakun of Demian. It's already time to wrap up the second、oh. hour of our fourth day as DJs. Oh my gosh, how was it? Well, Nakun. Well, first I want to say that I was looking through my Twitter account、yeah. while we were listening to the two songs. Yes, yes, yes. Some listener, some of our listeners think that tomorrow is our last day. Nope,、But、nope, nope. We're we actually have... here until Sunday、yeah. and Saturday, so I think you should. We, yeah, we got like seven days, and this is our fourth. So we did like we more, more than half, more than half of our show, and yeah, we were doing good. I think, I guess, <laughs> we were getting better. I guess, but I, I shouldn't say that. From we we could be better、uh, we could, tomorrow. We could be better tomorrow. Yes, and、uh, actually, our members are like our all members, like Demion, the, the completion of Demion, Demion is coming tomorrow. Yes, and yeah, we're gonna have like super much fun tomorrow. And I hope so. I hope they're studying English <coughs> right now.、Mm, anyways,、so. yes, <laughs> our last song. Yeah, our last song for today is "Time Is Running Out" by Muse. We'll be happy every day, right? right so、yes. see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow with Demion. Bye. Bye.